Hello everybody, welcome back. So today I thought I'd show you a little more of some of the beginning process. So here you can see I've got my level out, had some popsicle sticks to make sure everything was good. Wanna make sure you don't move that off its level base. You can also see that I've painted my base red ahead of time, just the corners and the sides. That just helps to make sure that I don't have too much uh, or any white canvas showing underneath. Um, if you take the time and do this bit of prep work at the beginning, it will save you in the end from having to go back and cover some white canvas that's showing or anything like that. Um, and especially if you didn't save any of the original paint, then you could encounter some problems there too. Um, as you can see midway there, I kind of switched blow dryers. I had bought myself a new one for this, but it is not doesn't work so that one will become my hair one I guess and I will stick to my old one for now so I'm doing a Dutch pour as you can see I am going to start building two lines I want to do the kind of the bow tie look on each side so I've started with black here mistakenly next I put down the yellow I thought there was enough white in my yellow and then I didn't have blue in my black, but I did. So it did combine a little in the end to make some of that uh, weird green that I'm not a huge fan of, but that's okay. Next, I added the orange as you saw, and then I'm just throwing in a little bit of titanium white here. Love the way those colors mix together. Here is my base color. Let's blow that over once we torch the air bubbles. When you blow the base color over your puddle colors like that or your lines, this gives you much more mixing of all of your colors and mixes your base in a lot more, rather than just straight blowing without putting your base color over top, if that makes sense. <laughs> okay, here we go. Now, as always, got to fiddle with it for a little while. I've sped this part up and edited some of it out because it took me a while and didn't need you guys to be sitting here for an hour just watching me fuss and blow and play and... But it just kind of gives you an idea how much, you know, can be fiddled with and how much things change. Don't forget to scrape your drips, super important. I love how this turned out. The mixing was great. The only thing I don't like is that green you can see in there. Not a huge fan. It didn't go too bad in this one, but I wish I would have layered the colors a bit differently. I will definitely redo that again and not put the yellow next to the black. Let me know what you guys think. Overall, I'm, I'm mostly pleased. Leave me a comment below. And as always, make sure you're subscribed.